One of the most common things that, that we get called for is cracks in foundation walls. Most poured foundations, it's pretty natural to have, you know, slight cracks from settling. It's the larger cracks, it's the shifting, the shearing, the actual movement of the foundation. Those are the issues that, that we tend to really perk up and take notice of. And with a, a block foundation, it's very common that the walls may be bowing or pushing, uh, or you may have a step crack where the actual, you can see the outline of the block from where it's been moving. If you see cracks in the basement walls and the concrete walls, uh, it's usually something that you want to take a look at and, and maybe monitor over some time. And then the other thing to take a look at is your floor, if there's stepping in your floor. And of course, once the foundation starts to move, you're going to have some issues on the upper part of the house. Cracking in the sheetrock on the walls, doors sticking, windows sticking, not being able to close. All of these are generally signs that there's something structurally going on with the house. Ignoring it is a bad idea, as well as replacing it can be a bad idea. Most of the time, the problem isn't with the foundation. It's normally with the soil conditions around the house and under the house. In many cases, the house may have been built on a marshy piece of land that may have been, had a lot of fill, which leave air pockets, which then leave the possibility for a structural movement on top of it. We can do the repair, we can fix the foundation, we can take the weight of the foundation off of the soil and put it on the piers. We can anchor the foundation, we have a carbon fiber repair system that we can use. Certainly all of them less expensive and more permanent than doing a replacement or just completely ignoring the problem.